Ay, no sé si está firmando. Sí. Hi there. Today I'm going to show you how to make a scrunchie for your hair. It's very simple. You need just two elements. A piece of fabric, rectangular, and a rubber band. And a sewing machine is ideal. You can sew it by hand, but it will take a long time. The first step is to measure the full stretch of your rubber band. This will help you choose how much fabric to use. Here we use centimeters. So the full stretch of this rubber band reaches 23 centimeters. So my rectangle fabric should be 23 centimeters long by as wide as you'd like. The more fabric you use, the poofier it will be. So the first step is to take your rectangle and fold it together right sides together in half, like so. Go to your sewing machine and sew that one side, like this. You put it in. There we go. And I put in a, lot, a large stitch. So what you're left with for now is this. Clip off the excess. The next step, after doing this, make sure your seam isn't that big. You put it on your wrist. I hope you can see. This is one of my first videos, so I may not be as smooth as other videos you've seen. Then put the rubber band on like this and fold it over the rubber band, like that. Now find the seam, put the seams together, and fold the raw edges inwards, like this. Then go to your sewing machine and sew as close to the edge all around uh, you will have the seam showing, so try to be neat about it. I will only do a portion of it, and then I'll just show you the final result, which I have here. Um, I like to start at the seam, right on the very edge, and as you're sewing, you fold in the raw edges. So sew a little, Fold in the raw edges. So, where you folded it, stop. Fold in the raw edges. So, etc. When you're finished, you, you end up going all the way around to the end. So, here's an example of one I made out of a teal or fluorescent blue fabric. You see, I started here, it's kind of showing a lot. But then I sewed around, around, the raw edges are folded inwards. And there you have your scrunchie. You can make it out of any kind of fabric. This is a stretchy fabric. This is a non-stretchy fabric. You still use the same amount of fabric for the poof. The stretchy fabric just gives you added elasticity. But it's no different. You still have to use more fabric to make it poofy. Uh, I made some less poofy ones. This one I use a little bit shorter amount of fabric. You notice it's less poofy, but it's still nice. So that's a good idea for you to use your scraps of fabric with when you're finished with your sewing project. Thank you for watching.